Morning. I still got several designs left to check. Let's hang out when I'm finished. Okay, babe. Hello, my friends. My name is Lucky. Well, she can just teleport too. Why don't I know how to teleport? My name is Lucky. Welcome back to another episode of my time at Sandrock. Boy, howdy. Do we have um action? Look at this. We got the whole action outfit. There we go. We got two closets full of clothes. Nothing is cooler than that. Man, I am still reeling from the last episode. Look at my look at my toolbar. It is just filled with weapons. We went to war and we won. Where's my front door? Look at this beautiful photo. Hold on. Oh, here we go. Let's put this photo in there. I love that photo. Okay, cool. Well, we'll have to get some more photos. We have a, a thing that we could hang here. Edit home, where is it? I know I always get super distracted. It's unbelievable actually how easy it is. Um, we had one hell of a day yesterday. Did we not? Oh my gosh. That was probably the longest episode I have ever recorded. And now, I don't even know what we gotta do. Well, we gotta finish this road to Portia. I guess we've defeated Duvos. Um, I, I just came by to thank you in person. Look at how awesome they look. We never would have stood a chance against Duvos without you. Tracking down Logan, discovering the secrets under the temple, piecing it all together, then finally preparing and defending us against invasion. All in a day's work, Trudes. Any one of those things would have made you a hero. But you continue to go above and beyond the call of duty as both a builder and a member of the Civil Corps. Above all, you've been a good friend to everyone around you. Here. The city put Ooh, together cool. a little something for you. I know you didn't do what you did for any kind of reward, but I'd feel better if you got something from us for all you've been through. Well, thank you. Oh, right. I also wanted to ask you to join our emergency fireside meeting. It's about how to handle the fallout from, well, everything. It's starting now. Don't worry. It won't take long. Let's go. Are there people from the free cities? Yes. Oh. Hello, everyone. Seems we're all here. Let's begin. <laughs> I love that they're still dressed up in their fancy outfits. First, I'd like to introduce the commander of the Alliance forces that came to our aid, Avery. As soon as Haru arrived in Atara, he mobilized a defense force in no time flat. Greetings. Yes, as soon as we heard the news, we set off without delay. The leader of the Alliance Guard personally chose me to handle this mission. We hardly dreamed they would be so bold as to attack us so deep in Alliance territory. It's pretty crazy when you think about it, dude. This guy's outfit is awesome. Look at his cape. I want a cape like that. Our air wing chased the enemy air destroyer all the way to the Duvos border. We can confirm that it went down a little afterwards from taking heavy fire. We've also done several sweeps of the northern ruins, arresting all of the leftover Duvos troops. Nice. I can confidently state that Sandrock is now completely safe. Ooh, as much as I want to believe him, I don't. Man, this outfit is dope. This attack was a blatant breach of our ceasefire. Rest assured, Duvos will answer for what they've done here. Does this mean Grace is going to leave? I don't want her to. I want her to stay. You want to hit him back? Well, that don't mean war. The Alliance values peace above all else and has no intention of provoking war. However, we have never and will never back down from a fight. Good to hear. Say, Commander, I don't suppose you could take a few of these criminals off our hands? Our jail only seats six comfortably and, well, we gotta uphold our own standards, else we're no better than they are. Oh yeah, let's see, who do they, they have, um... Well, they've got Pen. Is, do they have Pen right now? They at least have Yan and Miguel and a magic mirror. <laughs> we will stay in Sandrock briefly to prosecute any other missions Mayor Trudy has in mind for us. Then we'll leave with all Devos prisoners, including the war criminal Pen. Nice. Everything will be smooth, so long as we're not interrupted. All right, dope. Smooth as jackmail butter. <laughs> That's how we do it around here. <laughs> Let us know if we can help. All right. I said... So long as we're not interrupted. Okay, so leave them alone. Stay out your hair. Gotcha. Poor Commander, justice. has your company received any ACI orders? Official orders have not been received. However, it has become clear to me that you have been in clear violation of a 735, 
which warrants an evaluation by your superiors. What does this mean? That's funny. I thought I was up for a Medal of Honor. There are no medals awarded for back talk. Go <laughs> to Atara at once and take it up with your superiors. <laughs> what violation? Is it she incorporated us into the plot? Grace is headed out. Hey, that's right. I forgot she wasn't part of the Sand Rock crew for a minute there. I'm gonna miss her. That's so sad. What should I say? Pen, you can be extra rough with him. What kind of punishment will Pen receive? We'll miss you, Grace. Won't you stay, Grace? What about Miguel and Yan? We'll miss hey, you. Hey, well, don't miss me yet. I haven't received the order. I expect they'll want me around for at least a little longer to oversee things as a rep from the ACI. Nice. Well, certainly you wouldn't mosey before going on one last ride, would you? <laughs> this is cute. Is there like a thing happening here? Please tell me there is. Wouldn't dream of it. <laughs> yes. One last ride. Look at that. Look at that look right there. <laughs> what should I say? Oh, I can ask all of them. Cool. Pen, you could be extra rough with them. I see. You must really hate him. Yeah, he sucks. Man, this guy is intense looking. Look at his eyes. I understand. But as your commanding Civil Corps officer here said, we must uphold certain standards. He will be dealt with, but in a way that is neither cruel or unusual. Even though we all know such scum deserves far worse. Okay, well, at least we can all sit and talk about it. What kind of punishment will he receive? He was integral in the subterfuge against Sandrock and a leader in the attempted theft of the Alliance relics. Rest assured, he will be held accountable to the full extent of the law. I'll make sure of that personally. All right. Pen is not only a senior officer of the Duvos army, he has a criminal record on and off the battlefield. He has taken countless lives and surely would have taken more if not for you all. He'll get what's coming to him. Excellent. Let's see, um, what about Miguel and Yan? Are those two? As citizens of the Alliance, they fall under local jurisdiction. The corrupt commissioner will be held here while he is investigated formally by the Free Cities Commerce Guild and subsequently replaced. Who are they going to get to replace him? Make it me, Ann. I don't want to do it. You know, I'd like to. Maybe I even can. First step is headed back to HQ to report on what's happened here. Okay. From there, well, who knows? I mean, you're a pretty badass, like, undercover operative. I can't imagine you coming back and just, like, working at the kitchen. Uh, there Thank we go. Thank you again, Commander Avery, for your timely arrival. The City Hall will be cooperating with you as best as we can also. Next, Commander Avery, I believe you had some commendations you wanted to give out to award those who went above and beyond the call of duty in uprooting the Duvos conspiracy against Sandrock. Let's go, medal time. The first person we'd like to recognize is you. Me. Not only did you help mount our defenses against unfathomable odds, you led the charge into enemy territory, all for the good of our people and the citizens of the Alliance. That's what I do. Furthermore, these guys are not that impressed. Calm in the face of danger. Logan, the monster hunter's fighting skills surely tip the scales in our favor. And Grace, of the ACI's espionage and cunning, were invaluable in our victory against Duvos as well. Let's give them all a big round of applause. What a group of badasses. Yay. Commander, please present everyone with their awards. Nice. <laughs> and then me in my ridiculous outfit. Cool. I think that about wraps it up for today. Dope. Thank you all. And a big thank you to the heroes of the Battle of Sandrock. With brave folks like you around, there's no limit to what we can accomplish in this town. I suppose if there's anything you want to say to our prisoners... You'd better say it now. Who knows if we'll be seeing them again anytime soon. Do I want to say anything to them? Probably, shall we then? Yes. Dismissed. What about Logan? He's just like, all, like, are we, there's no way that we're going to charge him with anything, right? He's good. Hmm. Pen. I can't get that smirk out of my head. If he gets anything less than life over Natara, I'm going to be after myself. 
nice. Um, okay, we need to change up this outfit. It's just a little too silly. Let's start with, um, let's go back to the classics. Here we go, something a little more. I do love these uh, Royal Desert Warrior boots. Nice. I'm gonna. I'm gonna wear that for sure. <laughs> One hundred percent. Okay. Wait. Where's my little tool belt? There we go. Cool. <laughs> yes. Okay. Let's get out of here. All right. What in the world do we have to do now? Let's take a look at the map. Is there anything special going on? Oh yeah. We can definitely. We could go say bye to these dorks, right? Oh look. She hasn't even left the house yet. Let's go see what's going on. Oh, I got the new shotgun. This thing is so cool. I can just shoot my gun. Go, deputy. Oh, he's, he's not locked up? What? Hmm. Hmm, so Matilda and all her plots were foiled by you and the Civil Corps. Perhaps there is some justice in the world after all. Uh, goodbye, Miguel. Come on, Burgie boy. Just say it. Tell him what you told me. Burgie boy. Oh, I don't know. I'm sure everyone's real busy. No one in jail is busy. <laughs> Just say it. <laughs> yeah, tell me, old pal. I'm all ears. Time to stand up to your bully, Burgess. Okay. If you nice. and Danby both believe in me, I can do anything. Bro, you're our pastor now. We believe in you. Pen? Hmm? Uh, I think... I think you really did some bad stuff. And the more I look back and think about things, the more I realize a lot of the things you did to me in particular were not very nice. But, you know, it's not really about me. I mean, the things you did to other people were way worse. Give it to him, Burgess. Is this this is as tough as Burgess is gonna get. Anyway, I just thought you should know. Yeah. I I don't think we should be friends anymore. Yeah. <laughs> Oof. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Hark. <laughs> cool. Is that it? Um, I guess so. I've never had to friend break up with someone before. Do you remember when he caught us cutting down a tree and he was like if you keep doing this, I don't know if we could be friends anymore. And he was genuinely distressed. And I remember thinking like, what is this guy's deal? Well, now I understand. You're a mess, Pen. You had a cool friend like Burgess here who had you back no matter what. You threw it away and you don't even care. Get help, man. I mean, this is kind of gonna fall on deaf ears. Like this guy's a total sociopath. <sighs> I'm sure I will. These high security prisons always have a shrink on staff to try and make us feel bad about what we did. I pity you, Pen. Me too. You're sad, man. Listen, at least I tried to make things better for myself. You all just rolling around in the dirt praying for plants to sprout out of nothing in some backwater nowhere town. I mean... What happens if you succeed at even a, a slightly more inhabitable wasteland? Is that what you're mad about? That we're out here trying to make life work? I could have been rich in a big city admired by all living it up. I could have been a true hero. I risked everything and I lost everything. Those were the rules. So forgive me if I seem less than devastated by the loss of a few friends. Total narcissist. What happens if we succeed? Well, I'll tell you. We build our city up to be the best it could be. We become a shining example of what Telesis yes. can really accomplish. Preach. And we make the world a better place. First for Sandrock, and then for all the free cities. Preach, Pastor Burgess. Preach. Woohoo! Telesis! Yes. Um... <laughs> he sucks so bad. Hmm. Whatever happens, Pen, I believe no one is beyond the reaches of the light. 
even someone like you with their hearts so deep in the shadows. The, these guys still have their swords. Uh, you know I never believed in any of that junk, right? Even if you never believed in the light, the light believes in you. Ew, okay, I'm starting to feel bad for me too. Prison, sure, but torture, I did not sign up for. Yeah, you know what? Feelings mutual, bub. Let's get out of here. Sandrock needs us. Hey, what's up with Rian or Riri? What's going on with that guy? Goodbye, Pen. That was really hard for Burgess, wasn't it? That's kind of sad. Yes. Let's see. It's not too late to change. I hope you rot in prison. Well, if your alliance pals have anything to say about it, I suppose you'll get your wish. Ouch, though, Skinny. I mean, I thought we were at least still kinda cool. Nah. I mean, I didn't even kill anyone you know personally. Or you! <laughs> Which I guess goes without saying, being that we're having this conversation and all. Say, why don't you come and visit me sometime? That is, if I don't bust out of here before then. Ah, my sweet, sweet Skinny. Your words denounce me, and yet, with your skinny legs, you stand before me. You know, we're the ones that defeated you. What's up with this magic mirror? Is he just in the prison now? Your coming here today speaks volumes. The fact that you seem to think there's still something you can do. <laughs> if there was still some shred of my own heart that still did yet beat, I do not doubt that it would be moved. Hmm, just think of all the battles we've had, each one more glorious than the last, all stemming from that fateful day when I taught you the ropes. <laughs> As I recall, you were on your way to, to do some boring thing that nobody could care less about. That's true, he did kick our ass the first time that we met, and now we've kicked his ass. Ah, the student has indeed become the master. Hmm. Farewell. All right. Well, that was sort of interesting. Oh, Yan. Hmm? You stopped Duos for getting those relics, huh? Bet running around playing hero got you behind on your commissions, didn't it? Just admit it, newbie. You lot are a wreck without me. Give me my old job back and we can make all this just go away. <laughs> He's just insufferable until the end. Uh, cute desert defender pants. Ooh, I kind of like those. But no, aren't we still saving up for... We got hearts on the butt. Whoa, dreamy action helmet. What is this thing? Cyber Kitty helmet? What? Cyber Kitty duster? There's even crazier outfits. Super duck See, Oh my God. What are these? Can I make these? What? Oh look, there's different ones. That's cool. Okay, well, they are right. I am behind on my job, on my chores, on my work for the day. Great job, by the way, Danby. I'm very proud of you. Let's find my yak whistle and let's go see about getting some work done. We still have a bridge to Porsche to build. Isn't that true? Where's my freaking whistle? Oh my God, our bags are so full. I got to do something about this. There it is. There you are. Come my sweet yak. Whoops, sorry, sorry. All right, do I have no quests? Let's take a look. Nothing. There is nothing for me to do. Is there anything on the map? No. My God. My God, so what's going on with the road to Portia? Isn't it? Am I just waiting? Am I just waiting to find out? I guess so. Okay, well, we have ourselves a little bit of a reprieve. A little bit of a reprieve. Oh, let's chat with Burgess. Let's see how he's feeling. Oh, you've done a great thing. Our church is a lot more lonesome these days, but through no fault of your own. I hope when I hope one day everyone can find salvation after what they did. You know, you catch are you kind. <laughs> catch you later, sweetheart. You are kind to the end. Okay, let's clear these. Uh, oh. Crap, my inventory is so full. Let's do this. Sort all, confirm. Let's take a look and just fix this really quick. Okay, there we go. Uh, that was one whole thing of it. Oh 
<laughs> We've got these crazy terracotta things. Okay, that's enough space. I don't have to worry for a little bit. Although I think we are about due for a full like storage reorganization. Let's see what's going on in the mail from Trudy. Now that the dust has settled on the Duvos fiasco, we still have serious matters to address. While we appreciate the help Logan has provided for the town, we need to understand and assess the lengths of his banditry. After discussing the matter with the civil courts, we have decided to open this to the town as the circumstances are particularly unique. We will be holding a trial for Logan and Haru in three days' time in front of City Hall. This is regarding the future of two sand rockers. Please attend and give us your ideas. Everyone's opinion counts. Well, obviously he's innocent. Let's see, thanks for your DLC purchase. Thanks for your DLC purchase. Thanks for your DLC purchase. Okay, well, that's wild. I didn't expect that we were going to have him on trial. Why don't you return home? Uh, let's gather up as much of this as possible. And um, I guess I'm just gonna look at the, the commission board and see what I can make. Let's see, titanium scrap. Sure, that one's new. Nice. Um, I guess, you know, one thing we could focus on is maybe see about upgrading some of these machines because they are in need of some upgrades, aren't they? Look, this one's ready to upgrade. Um, that might be the one to do. I'll do a second one of those. Let's take a look and see what's going on on the commission tracker. Uh, this can't be that hard. I really don't want to go get these petrified wooden boards, but I might do it. Limestone brick would actually be kind of fun. I really don't want to make... Um... We did just get a ton of this meat too. Let's see if we can make this one. Okay. We've gotten two of those. I would love to make another super dew collector. Oh, we need more tempered glass right here. Nice. Boo doo doo doo. Pick up. All right. Sick. Um, where are we going to start putting these? I guess we could put them on the other side of this, right? Something like that. Why can I never see these? There we go. Cool, let's go gather all this stuff up. Um, I wish that, I guess I could just sell these. Um, Cause we don't really need them anymore. We're gonna just replace them with all the super new collectors, but we'll mass a little bit bigger of a collection of these. Okay, so limestone bricks. Something tells me that's like a thing here. Uh, aluminum plate, did I only need two? Yes, I only needed two more, that's nice. Would be nice to upgrade this. Um, and it looks like I have all of the parts. Let's do it. Okay, nice. We've got two upgraded ones of those. What about this bad boy? What can we do to upgrade this? We need steel gears and marble bricks. I want to say the steel gears, magnesium steel gears. How many did it need? Three? Just two. Just two of these and two marble bricks. And then marble bricks is, I guess that's probably here, right? Okay, and then it says we need six limestone bricks. Easy enough. Cool, what does this take to upgrade? We want more of these. That's right, magnesium, chromium, furnace core, and marble bricks. Oh, short on spinel. Okay, cool. And then that'll get us two of each of those. Now it's steel blades and two more marble bricks. So let's do this. Okay. 
We're getting low on these manganese steel bars. You know what? We have not been smelting ore for a long time. Ooh, this'll be fun. Where's my goofy little vacuum? Did it go back into my um, storage? No, it's right there. We're going to need more iron, aren't we? We got to tell the we got to tell the the fellas to make more iron so we can do that today. Why don't we put We already own 173 of these. Okay, we don't need more of those. Ooh, we never made titanium aluminum alloy. Let's do that. How many can we queue? Can we do some of this white copper is two? No, Q is full. Okay. Do a bunch of those. Okay, we're gonna need a ton of iron. So we should go update our contracts, I think. Cool. Okay, so do, 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 do. So I guess we're just having a super chill day. Did we just forget about the road to Porsche? Oh, that's right. We need to make meat stuffed mushrooms. Well, there we go. There we go. Let's freaking go. Let's go head out there. I'll have them run around with this uh, silly, silly vacuum cleaner on my back. Um, hold on. Oh, those mushrooms are growing. How cute. Uh, this whole area over here is kind of unexplored. So maybe we could just explore the outside a little bit while we're over here. It's, we have literally nothing else to do. So we did tell them to bring us the most iron that we possibly can. So we're getting it. Uh, what happens if I upgrade the contract? Can I get even more iron? There we go. Okay, rare ore. Let's get a good spread of everything. But let's get the most of this. I feel like this is the stuff we need the least of. We'll do 10 of this. The most of this. There we go. That's gotta do it, right? I don't even think I need this stuff for a while. Maybe I'll turn this down even more. There. There we go. Contract level maxed. Okay, beautiful. Um, Let's see. What is making that terrible noise? <laughs> the noise they make is so funny. Okay, well, I'm going to need this. So I guess we'll just explore this area. We got nothing else to do. Let's see what we can find. Oh my gosh, we leveled up. Great. Do you know what? There was another place down in, do you remember? This was so long ago now, but down over here, there was like, I built two ladders. And then when I fixed it, there was another ladder and we never completed that. So I have no idea what's over there. Jerk, weak. I guess I don't even really need to fight these guys. I can just run around and see what's over here. 
more of these birds. Oh, you know what I probably could kill now? I could probably kill the death bird. Um, that looks dangerous. Ooh, I kind of want to go try and kill the death bird. Would that be a wild thing to do today? Let's finish looking around over here before we do anything else. Okay, there's clearly nothing over here. Level 37 Cockadoodle Doom, though. Super strong. A little bit of scraps. So this is just a big open area with nothing in it. There is a chest here. Boo, boo. Hello? Ooh, two gravity motors. God, that's nice to find. Well, these guys had a little camp, and I just came over here, and I just murdered him. Look at this guy. He's just over here with his pet scorpion, trying to live his life. I really didn't need to do this. I feel kind of terrible about it. Sorry, bud. We are born and sworn enemies, and there is nothing we can do about it. Um, what's down here? There's a super Tripleon. Okay. Uh, besides that... Wait, how the hell do I get out of here? Okay, so there's really not much over here, I guess. I thought there'd be more cool stuff to check out, but apparently not. Just some chests and some bad guys. Normal stuff. Um, hopefully this is like two more gravity motors. Ten water, nice. You guys are like super weak sauce now. Come here. I just want the spinel, that's all. huge. We'll take an hour. I kind of want to take this death bird on. I really do. Why are you hiding behind the bush, you crazy beast? Oops. Where was it? It wasn't it near like some great big bones. I think it's over here somewhere. Yes. Ooh, look at how crazy it looks with the sun setting. There it is. This thing kicked my ass before. Um, Yaki Poo. Stay. I have no bullets. Oh my god, it's terrifying looking. I 
I'm just shooting it to death. This is kind of terrible. Got it. What did we get? Ooh, seven relic bags and 25 ruin tokens. Whoa, that's not bad. I don't mind the ruin tokens at all. Let's see, where are the relic bags? Data disc, toy soldier, toy soldier. Toy soldier, this dude loved toy soldiers. Toy spear soldier and toy sword soldier. Sailor's coin. Sweet. That was so freaking easy. Oh my God, that thing one-shotted me the first time I ran into it and now I just walked over it. We we are the, the most terrifying thing in all of Sandrock now. Nothing can stand in our way. Not even, not even Duvos, not even the might of the Duvosian army can stand in the way of such power. Um, I will ignore you, you stupid scorpions. Okay, let's head home. It's bedtime, it's late. It's late, we've had a long day. We've had a very chill day today. There's very little that we needed to do. Let's go. Dun, 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 dun. There's Rocky's kid. Peck. Um, I should probably put all this water that I've acquired in here. Let's take a look. Jeez, that didn't even fill it all the way up. That's crazy. Okay, I don't know what this thing's problem is. It's just bugging out on us. Let's see. Limestone brick, nice, so that's done. Aluminum alloy plate, that's done. Um, Is it too late to be turning these in? No, because she's coming home right now. Yay, hey babe. Hey there. Hmm. Knew I could count on you. Of course. We get a lot of points for that. Hmm. Wait. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Howdy. See. Hey, Anki. Everyone's amazed at what you and the Civil Corp were able to do. And to think that there was always a half functioning spaceship only just over the hill that away. Shoot. Looks like I owe Director Chia soda. <laughs> you guys had a bet about that? That's hilarious. Catch you later. Catch you later. Come on. Let's go home. What is going on with this thing? That bugs me to no end. Okay. Oh, we haven't pet any of our animals, nor have we cleaned up their poop. I am so sorry. Let's do this. Let's do this. And then we will probably retire. In fact, as I'm doing these chores, I'll say, my friends, thank you so much for watching to the end. Hit the like button and subscribe. Leave a comment. Oh, and they're starving too. I am the worst. They're not going to grow if we don't feed them. There we go. Sorry, guys. I don't know why you still love me. I let you go hungry. It was a little crazy. Forget me. Uh, you know what? I, the game didn't even give me a chance to get home and do my chores. It was like, oh, you just defeated the Duvos army. Go straight to bed. Really? Not fair. Yakipu, you're standing on my freaking cactus. How are you even able to do that? All right. My friends, I appreciate you all so much. I will bid you farewell. And I really, really look forward to seeing you all next time.